All right, friends, so this video is for anyone that wants to remove rust from a bumper using kitchen supplies. This is a pretty simple technique that my husband did, and he's the star of the show. You'll see him scrubbing the bumper. You can also remove rust from other tools, other metal tools, using these two items that you can find in your kitchen. The first is ordinary tin foil. Straight up ordinary tin foil, take a bit of it and wad it up into a ball. Maybe take two bits if you have a lot of rust. And the second is Coca-Cola. The Coke that we used for this one was very old. It had to have been a year and a half old. It was sitting in our fridge. And every time I tried to throw it away, my husband was like, no, I'm gonna use that on the bumper. We need to keep it. So it was super old, super flat, and it still worked. If you have old Coca-Cola in your fridge, Definitely don't get rid of it. Don't dump it down the drain because you're just going to be pouring some money down the drain, which you don't want to do. Keep it to remove rust from anything metal in your life. This is a super easy hack using a couple of kitchen items to clean up anything metal. And here we go. So take a look at how we did this. This is our gorgeous 1983 Dodge Ram Charger. This was a Craigslist find by my husband. He trolls Craigslist and he came across this beauty. And every so often the rust reappears on the bumper as you can see here. I'm gonna to try to give you a really good view of the rust on the bumper. It goes all along the top edge. It's surface rust, not much goes through the bumper. As you can see, I think I'll pan down here, yep, a little bit. You can see that it doesn't really go down on the flat side of the bumper, the outside of the bumper, the part that would bump other cars. That's pretty clean. There's some slight pitting, but the top of the bumper is the worst. And here are the two supplies that we're going to use. So this Coke I mentioned before is really old. It's gotta be a year and a half old. We don't typically drink Coke. We had it for a party and it didn't get finished. And I've tried throwing it away several times and my husband is like, no, no, no. I'm gonna use this on the truck. So if you wanna clean up the rust off the top of your bumper, in a short amount of time, let's say you have a hot date, you wanna run over to a car show or something, the first thing that you're gonna do is wet down the bumper. We're using well water, we live on a well, so this is well water. The next thing that you wanna do is take the Coca-Cola and pour it over the rust, and when you do that, you can actually see some of it melt right off. That didn't show up on our camera, but it does, it melts right off. Add Coke to your wad of tin foil and then start putting in some elbow grease. And it doesn't take much. You don't have to push too hard. You'll find spots that are deeper that maybe you have to push a bit harder, but otherwise, gentle scrubbing with the tin foil on the rust will take it right off. I picked up the camera to try to show a closer view of the rust dissolving with the Coke. This has not been modified or edited besides cutting out some portions that would make this video longer than it needs to be. Cleaning up the whole bumper literally took about 10 minutes. And you just keep adding. You keep adding Coke to your wad of tin foil and scrubbing, adding it to the rusty parts of your bumper and scrubbing and you can go over it several times until the rust disappears. This fix typically lasts about a year, maybe a year and a half for the metal that's exposed to weather. If you have metal like a metal tool that's not exposed to weather it should last quite a while to take off the rust and so i'm speeding up the video here but i want you to be able to see the whole process of him managing the entire bumper there was a little bit of rust around the license plate holder and he got in there with the tin foil but the only two products he's using besides water we sprayed it down with water are coca-cola and ours is very old and tin foil You'll notice that your tin foil starts to degrade, and that's fine. We stayed with that one piece of tin foil that you saw in the beginning. We didn't grab a new tin foil, we just stayed with that one. And once you get everything to the shine that you like, once you get it to where the rust is removed, you hit it with some water, wipe it down, and take a good look at it. If you find any spots that you're unhappy with, go over them again. 
it'll shine right up. You'll see that the rust again just disappears. It just melts right off as soon as you hit it with the Coca-Cola. Rinse off the Coca-Cola when you're done, dry it up, and if you want to really make it shine, hit your bumper with a coat of wax. I'm uber excited that this bottle of Coke is now out of my fridge and the bumper of our Dodge Ram Charger is ready to go for the season. And here's the final product. Now this is not with wax. I don't have any images of it in this video after being waxed. All this is is the Coca-Cola, the tin foil scrubbing off the rust, and slightly dried with the kitchen towel that you saw before. Super shiny bumper, two products from your kitchen, and you are good to go for the season. As you live the dream this week, I hope that you be the change that you want to see and rock on.